are all forms of matter identical? Certainly not. You take a little water and then put it in freezer. It changes into ice. Heat it, it starts changing into steam. So, what is this? Has water changed? No, it is water only. In all the three cases, it is made up of hydrogen and oxygen and in the ratio of eight, 1 is to 8. So, that means it is same matter, but it exists in different states. This is what is called states of matter. Very common thing, we know that matter can exist in three states, solid, liquid and gas. Now, let us take the case of this duster. If I want, I can just draw around it. So, what I get? I get a shape. Can I do this with liquid, with water? I cannot. Anyway, let us focus only on the solid for, for time being. So, what we find is that solids have a definite shape. They also have a definite volume. When we want to press it, we find it cannot be compressed easily. So, it is hard. We cannot change its shape. Of course, there are exceptions. We can change the shape of a rubber band when we stretch it but then it comes back to the same shape. So, it is rigid. Now, see this again a solid. There is one even surface on top of it. We can I can feel the surface. So, they have a surface. In the case of solids another thing is that they cannot flow. And all these features are because of one reason that is the molecules of solids have a very strong force of attraction. And because they are our very good friends, very strong force of attraction, the molecules are very close to each other. There is hardly any space between these molecules. which also means that the kinetic energy is less, force of attraction is more. So, these are some of the features of a solid. Now, let us change it to a liquid. First point, definite shape. Do liquids have definite shape? You get your milk in a poly pack or your milkman brings it in a can and then you pour it into a pan. The shape changes from poly pack which was almost square or rectangular or the can which was cylindrical to a pan which is of different shape. In fact, you can take any shape and it will take that shape. This is round bottomed flask. Now, it is looking round. Conical flask. Tube. So, they do not have definite shape. They take the shape of the container. No definite shape. However, 
definite volume is there. When the milk is one liter, whether it is in polypack shape or it is in the shape of a pan or where or in a glass or a tumbler or a katori, it will remain one liter only. So, the volume is definite, it is not hard, not rigid, but it has a surface like this is the surface which means the molecules are close enough to form a regular covering and that is what is the surface. And can it flow? Of course, I pour the I put this it remains here only, but had I poured milk here what would have happened? It would have reached there because it can flow. Now, why all this in the case of liquids? Because in the case of liquids, the force of attraction between the molecules is not so high. It is something like you can say, say solids are like children in the classroom, where they have to follow certain discipline. So, they are sitting in a certain way and when they come to assembly, walking up to the assembly ground or when especially in the break, they can move around a little more freely, but still they are only in the school premises, right. So, they are close, but not as close as a solid. So, naturally the intermolecular space is much more, this is solid, this is liquid. Now, what happens when it is gas? You burn a kind of incense stick or something is being cooked at home, you enter and you say, oh mom, this is what you are going to cook today. Or as they say, in small flats, even when you cook cabbage, everybody knows in the community that cabbage has been cooked. But otherwise, if you are just there is some milk, liquid or solid, no, unless they see it, they do not know. But the smell reaches everywhere because it is in gaseous form and in the case of gases, it is something like you are in the playground. You can just say you are playing football. Did you watch AFR matches? So, what happens there? Everybody is moving freely. Of course, they are also within a field, but otherwise they are much more free to move. That is the state of gaseous state, which means the molecules can just about move anywhere, which means of course, no definite shape and also no definite volume. No definite volume of course, is not hard, of course, is not rigid, there is no surface also. But like a liquid, it can flow. In fact, it can flow much more at a much greater rate. And why? Because the force of attraction between the molecules is much less and so space is more. Whenever force is more, space is less. So, it is inversely proportional just like your friends. When you are very friendly with somebody, you feel very close, but with others you may not be so friendly. Like for example, within your class you must be having your best friend or maybe a group of 3, 4 friends. So, they are like solids. If you take into consideration all classmates that is like liquid and what about the schoolmates? You have attraction for them, you know them, but you are not so close. So, that is like a gaseous state. What is CNG? Compressed natural gas. And what is LPG? Liquefied petroleum gas. Now, here gas is within a cylinder or when gas is being filled in a balloon. So, it is very natural because there is so much of space between the molecules, the gas can easily be compressed. So, gases can be compressed. But what about solids? 
the molecules are already so close there is hardly any intermolecular space how can you further compress them you can't so this is also one difference that solids cannot be compressed i know you are going to tell me something you are going to tell me that sponges can be i know sponges can be compressed but that is because there is large pores air spaces which are filled with air so when we compress it or press it the air rushes out and once the air is out then it cannot be further compressed so this is very clear that solids in most of the cases cannot be easily compressed this you can also do with an injection syringe if you take an injection syringe and just or you can use pichkari which you use for your holi so if you fill some stones in it first of course remove the piston the piston has been removed so now if you try to press it further you can't but when doctor is giving you injection or when you are playing holy colors then you fill it with liquid and the piston can move and when there is no liquid only air is there of course the movement is much more smooth that is because gases can easily be compressed and but obvious when you are spread in the playground and your game teacher just calls you you can come closer but if you are sitting in those rows close to each other and i tell you now please squeeze in at just one child more you say ma'am there is no space so that is the situation in the case of liquids the molecules are so close to each other that they further cannot be that is why it is difficult to cut a piece of iron that means the molecules are very close but comparatively it is easier to tear a paper or maybe cut a piece of wood and some solids of course they are very soft like cheese or a metal like sodium or soap they can be cut but generally speaking the solids have less intermolecular space so they cannot be compressed and gases can be